Hello, my name is John Griffin, and today I'm going to be going over the Recycle Bin in Business Objects 4.2. Uh, what this is going to do is it's a way to um, retrieve reports that were uh, previously deleted or um, accidentally deleted. This definitely would have been very helpful in 3.1 from my end because uh, I've actually unfortunately deleted some accidentally, so this would have been a great uh, feature. But today I'm going to be going over the Recycle Bin, how to make sure it's set up. Uh, as well as actually use it. So let's go ahead and begin. Uh, first thing we're going to want to do is an administrator is going to need to log into the CMC and they're going to need to go to applications. Once you are in applications, you're going to want to go down to recycle bin applications. You're going to right click and click on properties. And what this is doing here, this, this is making sure that, one, it's set up. It's also, you can change the different uh, amount of days that it actually saves recycled reports. So what this is, this is like any recycle bin. Like if you go to your desktop and delete something, it's going to be going to a recycle bin. And then from there, uh, you can permanently delete them, permanently delete them in the recycle bin as well. Um, we're not going to do that today because we don't want to permanently delete the reports, but I'll show you how to do that. Okay. So as you can see here, typically, mine's already set up here, but you would want to go ahead and check the Enable Recycle in here. And then also what you'll want to do is, um, this says automatically remove files from Recycle Bin after 30 days. You can change that to whatever you want. So if, if you're wanting to save up to 60 days, you can do that as well. Um, it's kind of a fail safe. Typically we just keep it at the 30 day mark. Um, and then you'll hit save and close. And now what you'll do is you'll see this if you go back to the home page. You'll see Recycle Bin down here now at that point. And then just to kind of show you what that is, you can go in here. These are all reports that have been um, deleted at some point. Um, so what you can do is you can empty the Recycle Bin, which will permanently delete them, but we do not want to do that. Or um, some of the features you can actually see in here as well is if you click on a report and then you click on, you can either right click or you can click on the manage. And what this is going to do is you can permanently delete it. Um, you can restore it, which I'm going to show you here is what we end up doing. Or you can just kind of go to the properties and look up. Uh, it'll give you the CUID number if that's what you need. Um, it'll give you uh, the folder path. Uh, it'll pretty much just give you uh, the properties um, in a sense. Uh, but what we're going to do is, let me go ahead and show you what this is actually going to do. I'm going to open up <clears throat> Info View here. I'm going to click on Documents and then just in my favorites, I have a couple reports in here. Um, one of them is WCI Map Test. So I'm going to go in here, I'm going to right click and I'm going to delete it. So then what we're going to want to do is we'll go back to the CMC here. And under the CMC, I'll refresh this page. And now you're going to see a new report called WCI Map Test, the one I just deleted. So this recycle bin, it actually works for, um, for anything. So it works for folders, universes, reports, anything like that. So whatever you delete in here, um, it'll all be within this folder, which is great. Um, again, we didn't have that in 3.1, so it, it would have been a huge help. I uh, worked for, with 3.1 business objects for quite some time. Um, so this is a great new feature to have in 4.1. But just to kind of restore it, if you want, you can right click, restore. And what that did is if you go back here, you can see it's no longer in my favorites. But if I go ahead and refresh the page, it's back in my favorites. So there's a 101 on how to um, work the recycle bin uh, within the CMC. So just to kind of go back through those steps, it's making sure you have it enabled in applications. Um, then what you can do is you can kind of go see what's currently in your recycle bin. Um, you can go delete reports in info view and then you can come back here and you can click on the recycle bin and see which reports you have deleted in there, folders, universes, anything like that, and then just restore it. It's as simple as that. And uh, thank you very much.